If you are a lawyer, I really need your legal expertise here. Can Matthew Perry's assistant be charged with involuntary manslaughter? According to new court documents, Perry's assistant of nearly 30 years, the one that was administering to him intravenously the ketamine, found him in the days leading up to his death just in the last five days of being alive, found him unresponsive, meaning unconscious, passed out twice, at least twice. And despite those two super scary incidents, he continued to shoot up Matthew Perry. Then on the day that Matthew Perry died, his assistant shot him up at 8.30 a.m., then again around noon, and then 40 minutes later at 12.40 p.m., Matthew Perry told him, shoot me up with a big one. And that was the last thing he said to anyone. This, this all seems criminal to me, but I'm not a lawyer. So anybody that knows, please chime in in the comments section.